If a submarine suddenly loses power underwater, here's what actually happens. Modern nuclear subs usually patrol a few hundred feet below the surface, often around 600 feet, and can stay submerged for weeks or even months without surfacing. On nuclear boats a fault triggers an automatic reactor shutdown, called a scram. Crews then shift to batteries and an emergency propulsion motor to keep control. If they must surface fast, they can do an emergency blow, flooding high-pressure air into ballast tanks to rocket upward. Breathing isn't the first crisis. Subs carry oxygen sources and remove CO2 with lithium hydroxide canisters that work even with little or no power. If they can't surface, rescue protocols kick in. The Navy's SRDRs can attach to a disabled sub and transfer sailors. Some fleets deploy comm buoys to signal topside. Exact depths and timelines are classified and vary by class, but these are the real, publicly known steps that save crews. Like and subscribe for more.